Hey up, Rock God 2004 back with another video for you. I have had three things delivered today. One was uh, with Royal Mail. Actually, this was delivered yesterday. And two are from Amazon. I'm not expecting anything from Amazon. Um, I'm assuming somebody sent me them. That is all I can think. Um, and this... I have no idea who this is, right? But I'll cut my address up there. But all the lettering is like that. Now, my first thought, because of the lettering, was Jason Brett. Um, but this has been stamped at Nottingham Mail Centre, so that's what's making me think it can't be because he's Dan Landon. Um, so I opened it. There is no note to tell me who it's off or nothing. And I haven't read this yet, in case you're watching. Because I opened it when I was half asleep and then put it down and went back to sleep. So I still haven't read this. It is what looks like <laughs> a Viz. I think it's Viz. Comic strip. But with Iron Maiden in. Iron Maiden and the giant crabs of death. Oh, that's amazing. Bruce looks about 90. Steve, Dave, Adrian, Nico. Look at the nose on that. I know, Yannick. What the hell is wrong with you all? He's part of the band. Get over it. Um, I'm assuming that's it. It goes that side. <laughs> and then that side. Um, I think it's amazing. I do. It's been, it looks like it's actually being cut out of a magazine. It's not a copy or anything. Um, and I really do appreciate it, but thank you very much, whoever you are. But can you please let me know who it is who sent this? <laughs> Look at the clip of that. Their faces are amazing. I might take a photo of this and see if, see if Laura can put it on um, X or whatever it's called now and tweak them. They'll read that and be gone. I don't know why that cheeky bastards. Anyway, whoever you are, thank you very much indeed. Um, please let me know if it's bugging me. Um, and then there's 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 two of these. These have only just arrived at six o'clock tonight. At the time of recording, this is Friday night before Scott's stream. So I, I need to open these. This feels like uh, it's. I don't know. It's possibly a Blu-ray. It's possibly a DVD. This feels thinner. I have no idea where either of them are because I have no idea where the hell they've come from. I've had no message. Nobody said to me they're sending anything and I, I honestly cannot think. I don't have anything pre-ordered because I've had nothing come out. Well, should I say I haven't had a thing to say you've gone overdrawn or your payment's been refused. So I want to open this one. Oh, do you know what? Do you know, I have had two really cack days. Idiots on the road who can't drive. And just people getting in my way and in general just pissing me off. And now I get a nice little sip. What a bell end! <laughs> nice little surprise in the post. And both ends have snapped straight away. So even the cardboard is taking the piss out of me. This better not be anything to do with Barbie. Right, let's have a look. Sir. I have, what the hell is this? Oh! It is a DVD in a very, very thin case. I've never seen this. This is... Um, it's on a networker thing as well. Roger Moore, the man who haunted himself. I have heard of it, but I've never seen it. Yes, there's a note. I think I know this is off. And it should rhyme with smelly jelly, if it is who I'm thinking. I guess I'll never know. There's no note. It's just a pack and slip. Oh, please, there's got to be a note in this. Otherwise, that's three anonymous things I've had. I haven't got a clue. <sighs> yeah. 
It is a Blu-ray. Oh, wow. I've really been wanting to see this. Steve Coogan in Stan and Ollie. It's got to be dealt by this. It's got to be. This one's got a note. And a pack and slip. <laughs> yes, it is. I don't know whether I can. I tell you what. I'm not going to read this out. <laughs> you can read that yourself. Thank you very much, Delboy. <laughs> I think. Um, excellent stuff. Um, this isn't a Hammer film, is it? The Man Who Haunted Himself, not Roger Moore. Um, no, it's not. 1970. Maximum picture area version of main feature, whatever that means. Wow. 34 minute music suite of Michael J. Lewis's original score. That must be like audio only. It's nice when you get little things like that. Wow. Yeah. Never seen it in that packing before. Like, I thought, as I come up with it, card, it's got a barcode. Anyway. And that bit, Pete told me about this one as well. Um, Pete, Pete told me this um, Play Tendo guy. Um, told me that this is a really really good film um so i will leave links below <laughs> to del boy's channel pete's channel and scott's channel um i would leave a link to who sent me the uh comic as well but i don't know who the hell you are i mean, i did mention jason so i'll leave a link below to jason's channels as well just in case it is him and the fact i've mentioned him um but yeah del boy and mr anonymous or Mrs. Anonymous. Thank you so much. Very, very much appreciated. There you go. It was a nice little surprise after two khaki days, wasn't it? Um, it went... <laughs> if I ever do find out who said that, I will let you know. I'll mention it in a video at some point. Uh, I'm going to get going because I'm going on Scott's stream very, very shortly. Myself, the beautiful Scott, the most beautifulest Andy... And the bell end, Keith. So, get your ass over there. But then again, by the time you've seen this, it, it doesn't matter. Thank you very much for watching, all two of you. I really do appreciate it. Um, and thank you very much for your continued support. It means the world for me. Well, to me as well. Oh, God almighty. This brain rot. I hope it's got a cure. I am actually getting on my own wick. So God knows what you were all thinking. I'll see you very soon. You all take care of yourselves for me because I love you all dearly. Ta-ta.